Everyone, it is Mona here at Craft Clutch. Today is Friday, that means it is another Coaster Friday. Today we're gonna to be making an Angel Coaster. It is actually the last coaster of the year. For the Angel Coaster, I have about one ounce of resin mixed, and I'm gonna just take some acrylic paint and a flesh tone. I'm gonna drop some in, mix it right on up. Then I'll pour it into the mold, Pop any bubbles with my lighter, and we'll let that cure a minimum of 12 hours. The resin has cured. Now I'm going to take a liner brush, some black acrylic paint, and I'm just going to paint on closed eyes and some eyelashes. And I'll have to do two coats of that. And just a mouth like she's singing. I've mixed an ounce of resin and I'm going to pour it right on here. Now I'm going to take my lighter, pop the bubbles, and I will let it cure a minimum of 12 hours. The resin has cured so we can pop this right out. Now I'm going to take a piece of paper and I'm going to trace around the coaster and I'm just going to draw some hair. Then I'm just going to cut this out just like this. And now I'm going to trace it onto this yellow felt. So there's the one. And now I'm going to cut this part out and trace a second one. Then you want to cut both of these out. And you're going to want to cut on the inside of the marker line. All right, now you want to match it up. And I'm going to want to glue along the edges. I'm going to use hot glue. And I am not going to glue at the very top. And you'll see why. But really all we're doing is creating a little pocket. And you don't need much glue at all to tack this together. And you really only want to be on the edge. And you don't want to fill on the inside. You just want to do it up to the bottom. So now it's a little pocket that we can insert the coaster, just like this. Now we have a girl, but we do not have an angel yet. So now it's Operation Halo. So when it's not the holiday season, you can have her just a girl. In season, you can have her as an angel. Now this is just a wire from the dollar store, and we're going to turn it into her halo. Now I would suggest using a sturdier wire. I just don't happen to have any right now. But you'll get the idea on how to, to make it happen with whatever wire you use. I'm going to straighten this a little bit. I don't think our halo has to stick up too far, but we don't want to make it too short initially either. So I'm just going to give it a little bend here, and I'm going to come around. Now, I'm going to also give you a different option on how to make this a sturdier halo. Okay, now I'm going to just bring this together and twist it. And you can either cut that edge off, that last piece, and then bend it further with your pliers. And here's your halo. Now I'm going to bend it like this. And now this is what the halo is going to look like. And if you want to really have a sturdy halo, I would flatten this out, put a piece of packing tape under it, and then you can always put a thin layer of resin here. Let it harden, and then it will give it some body and some strength so your halo is not going to bend. But that's only if you want to do that. For my purposes, I am not going to do that. I have my rotary tool and depending on the thickness of your wire is going to determine the, the bit that you're going to use. Now I'm going to just drill right into her head carefully. Then you can shorten your wires you need. And there's my halo, and we'll see if we need to shorten it again. But first we'll tuck the coaster into the hair. And this is why we need that opening at the top, and we can make it smaller. And if you have a snug fit on the halo, you don't have to worry about it falling out. Now I can close this a little bit more, because I know where the halo is. Now this is a pretty soft wire that I'm using, but feel free to use something a little more rigid because I think you'll be happier. And here's our angel coaster. 
The nice thing about it is felt is very inexpensive, so if after using, um, if the hair gets stained or something, you can easily just cut her some new hair. You can change the style, you can change the color, and the halo doesn't have to stay in there because we have not permanently attached it, but as long as you have it in there snug, it should be fine. So here it is, here's your angel which is a fun holiday coaster. And for a little bit of extra shine, if you wanted to, you could always put a bead of glue around her halo and add some fine glitter. That would be pretty too. So be sure to let me know what you think of her down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like the angel coaster. I think she's kind of cute. And thank you for watching all year. I really appreciate it more than you know, and I hope you guys have the happiest of holidays, and I will see you next time. Remember, life is too short not to shimmer, so grab your glue gun and your glitter. Stay safe. Bye, guys.